Hey, my name is Macy. I'm 16, I live in Chattanooga, Tennessee, and I'm a total overachiever. I get good grades, I play softball, and I'm even on the cheerleading squad. But don't let that fool you, I do have a wild side. I'm all about dirt bikes. My boyfriend Ryan started chasing me when I was a sophomore. I wasn't into him at first because he rides four-wheelers, which to me are not cool. But eventually, he swept me off my feet. He even put a ring on my finger. Yes. <laughs> All my friends are psyched for senior year, but I'm graduating early and moving in with Ryan because <laughs> I'm pregnant. My name is Madison and I'm 16 years old. I live in Heber Springs, which is a small town in Arkansas. I'm very outspoken and it, it gets me in a lot of trouble. People already know I'm a bitch. I don't know what else to say now. My boyfriend's name is Christian, and he's 18 years old. At the time that I met Christian, I was a cheerleader, and Christian was a football player, and we just kind of hit it off, and we've been together ever since. <laughs> we've had our ups and downs, and sometimes he drives me absolutely crazy. Quit. My mom isn't really in my life. She lost custody of me when I was five because she struggled with drugs, and I haven't really seen her since I was 12. There's my dad mowing the lawn. <laughs> so I've been raised by my single dad. He's a trucker. He may look like a tough guy, but he's the biggest teddy bear I know. I'm Nick, I'm Madison's dad. I've raised my daughter to be a lot like me, and I just happen to be a pain in the ass, so now my daughter's a pain in the ass too. I have a big extended family. We live in two houses on a big piece of land outside of town. Money's tight and so is space, but I just hope there's room for one more because like it or not, I'm pregnant. Are you ready? I can't walk. My name is Amber, and I'm just your typical teen from Anderson, Indiana. My best friend Kayla and I entertain ourselves the best we can in this small town. My boyfriend Gary and I have been together for three years. He's a certified nursing assistant, and he spends his spare time playing video games. So, how did I meet Gary? That's a good one. You see, Gary graduated high school with my older brother, Sean, who's in Iraq now. One day, when I was in 10th grade, Gary called the house looking for Sean, and guess who answered? Hello? Is Sean home? Nope, he's out shooting squirrels. Amber? Gary? Amber, who are you talking to? It's scary. What does he want? Mom, Dad, and my brother were not too happy when I started dating Gary. Yeah, you're still a little baby to me, Amber. So you can imagine the reaction when I laid this one on him. I'm pregnant. Is he going to be OK once the baby's here? I'd probably be curious. I want to bite her. Go. Come on, come on. I'm Rochelle. I'm 19 years old, and I live in Tahunga, California. I come from a big religious family who immigrated from Guatemala. My parents want me to be the perfect American girl. I was always a straight A student. I always felt like that's the least I could do for my parents since they worked so hard to not only get us here, but let us live comfortably here. And this is my boyfriend, Chase. I met Chase at the gym. I saw him from afar and I thought he was cute. My family hasn't liked Chase from the start. It hurts my feelings when you can't be who you were before he came in the picture. They think he's controlling and cocky, not to mention that we were only together for two months when we found out I was pregnant. My parents were devastated because they felt their dream of me having a better life and becoming a doctor was over. I thought it was best to move in with Chase, but it's been difficult not having my family support, and I feel like everything is falling apart. We barely knew each other, got pregnant, and moved out. Just all happened really quick. Hey, my name is Leah. I'm 17 years old, and I live in the mountains of West Virginia, in a small town called Elkview. My house is pretty crowded. There's my brother, sister, and my mom. My dad left when I was little, so I really don't know him. Me and my mom are really close. She spoils me rotten, because I'm her firstborn. That's Regan, that's Rachel, that's me, and that's Alyssa. We're pretty much inseparable. We're all on the cheerleading team, and this year is our senior year of high school. <laughs> hey guys. 
This is Corey. He drove me home from a party one night and one thing led to another. Corey's two years older than me, but I'm definitely more mature. Why don't you listen to me? We just started dating and we're still getting to know each other. I don't know if we're gonna make it, but we're trying to stay together and work it out because light it. I lit it, Liz. It's lighted. It's lighted. It's lighted. <laughs> I'm pregnant with twins. Do you know how to change your actual diaper? I know how to change a diaper on a baby who wants their diaper change. Some babies don't like getting their diapers changed, so they... <laughs> and that's real difficult. Hi, I'm Maddie. I'm 18 years old, and I'm from New Braunfels, Texas. Look at my lovey. He's so cute. And this is my boyfriend, Corey. We met at a football game at his high school. And I yelled outside of the bus that he was cute and he should add me on Snapchat. And he did, and now we're here. Now we're here. Yay. <laughs> My mom and Corey have butted heads since day one. And she doesn't like the way he treats me. She has caught him texting other girls since she's been pregnant. She deserves better. Corey has cheated on me in the past, but he's working hard to change and I wish my mom could see that. Because in two months, we will be having a baby girl and I need them both in my life more than ever right now. I'm Kaylin. I'm a high school senior from Nazareth, Pennsylvania. Wow, you look like a princess. I'm a princess. Uh, Kendra. When I was six months old, my dad left and I haven't seen him since. My mom's always struggled to hold down a steady job, boyfriend, and home. She's currently living in a hotel with her new boyfriend, which doesn't leave much room for me. Hi, honey. Do you find any apartments yet? Well, I'm not gonna jump into purchasing a house now. I mean, that's, that's a huge investment. If I had to rely on my mom, I'd be lost. Thankfully, I met my boyfriend, Joe. You know I love you, right? Yeah, I know. We've been dating for nine months, and since I had nowhere else to live, his family invited me to move in with them. Are you gonna cut it? Since my mom's rarely around, Joe's mother, Janet, is like a second mom to me. Good job, go ahead, keep cutting it. Ever since Joe and I started sharing a bedroom, we've been really cramped and it's caused a lot of tension. You can have a bathroom in the bedroom. And things are about to get even more crowded because I'm pregnant. Hi, <laughs> this is my girlfriend, Cam. She's 33 <laughs> weeks pregnant. How's the baby? Um, she's good, I mean, she's not kicking right now because I'm standing up. <laughs> Hi, I'm Cameron. I'm a sophomore in high school and I live in Monroe, Michigan. I'm very outgoing, outspoken, and dramatic. Somebody better not be mean to me. It's all be me back. <laughs> oh, we know you will. <laughs> and so is my boyfriend. He's 18 and his name is Cam also. Some people think it's weird, some people think it's cute, but our friends call us Cam Squared. We've been together for a year and a half and he's my best friend. That's good. <laughs> I live with my mom, my stepdad, Sean, my younger brother, and two older stepbrothers. I also have a ferret named Ollie. My mom won't let me be independent and tries to control everything I do. Also, she has never gotten along with Cam. Cam does not like anybody telling him what to do. He can go from zero to 10 in two seconds flat. <laughs> the world is really crazy right now because of coronavirus. I had to leave my job, I'm doing online schooling, and my family is all stuck at home. On top of all of that, I'm pregnant. You know that feeling that you get when you're stressed out and you just can't take anymore and you literally just wanna freak out? That's what I feel like. Hi, my name is Caitlin. I'm 16 and I'm from Algonac, Michigan, a small town right across the river from Canada. During the winter, there's absolutely nothing to do around here, unless you like ice fishing. That's my boyfriend, Tyler. We've been together since seventh grade. You're a little flirt, especially in music class. We used to write notes back to each other. Yeah. My family situation is totally chaotic. Let's get her done. I've lived in 13 different houses since I was born. Hate moving. My mom is pretty unpredictable, and she can be really moody. She does her best, but I never know if she'll really be there for me. Um, my mom ended up driving drunk last night and got pulled over. I went to jail. Tyler's life has been hard too. His dad, Butch, has been in and out of prison for most of his life. Even though Tyler and I are used to surprises, nothing could have shocked us more than when our parents fell in love and then got married. So technically, we're step siblings, but we say that they're the weird ones because we were dating first. Even though it seems like a recipe for drama, for the most part, everyone gets along. But it's about to get a whole lot crazier around here because 
I'm pregnant. Everybody wave. My name is Kazmier, but people call me Cash. I'm 18 years old and I live in Avondale, Arizona with my grandma. Yeah, frying. <laughs> Shaking and baking. And twin siblings, Jason and Justice. Give my, my boyfriend's name is Nate. Dab me up. I like that. We met at school and we're both really into sports. I play basketball and I run track. Colleges were looking at me when I was a sophomore. They reached out to me because I was that good. Let's go, Cam! Let's go! I'm about to graduate high school and after that I want to go into the Navy so I can figure out what I want as a career and have money for college. But all of that is going to have to wait because I'm pregnant. Hi, I'm Brianna. I was born in Brooklyn, New York, and then moved to Orlando, Florida when I was 10 with my mom, older sister, and our dog, Prince. Hi, Prince. I've always been a good student. I even graduated high school a year ahead of my class. I'm really looking forward to starting college in the fall. I really like hanging out with my friends and taking pictures. Oh. My dad wasn't around much growing up but my mom has worked hard to take care of me and my sister. I think you can do college, and then from there you decide what do you want to become. The three of us are really close. We talk about everything. Shut up! You don't even know what you're talking about! My boyfriend Devon and I broke up a month ago, but I still love him and hope we can work things out because I'm pregnant. I wonder if we're actually a normal family and we just don't know it. My name is Callie. I'm from, oh, damn it, <laughs> I forgot my age. I'm 15 and I'm from LaPorte, Indiana. My boyfriend's name is Austin. He's also 15. We met in sixth grade and ever since then we've been together 24 seven. Everyone in that class I think rooted for us to be together. I always have thoughts that maybe I'm, I'm not attractive enough for him, but he always reassures me. I just thought, I just thought you were just like so beautiful. I just like really wanted to date you from there. <laughs> Her eyes were just like mind blowing. I just fell in love with it from there. We're finishing our freshman year in high school and figuring out what we want to do with our lives. I don't even know if I have any goals. <laughs> I just wanted to have fun and be reckless. Austin's dream is to get into Notre Dame and play football. I want to try to take some sort of college courses for like either like engineering or mechanics. I live with my parents and my younger sister Riley and my two dogs, Izzy and Elliot. My dad is not exactly easygoing. Austin, Kelly, shut up. So he loves to voice his opinion. I'm kind of naturally anxious. I'm stressed. I feel like the world's ending. Because it is. But even I didn't see this one coming. People are only allowed to go outside for essential needs like medical attention or food. A dangerous virus is taking over our world. And if this isn't crazy enough, I'm pregnant. We just both disagree and I just don't you don't have to have your way about every aspect of everything. I'm not trying to have my way. I yes, just... you are. I'm Jade. I'm 21. You just, like, are going on and on about the same thing. And that's my boyfriend, Sean. Are you happy? No, I'm not happy because you're being an ass. When we first met, I didn't think he was my type, so I friend-zoned him. But he wouldn't leave me alone. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. And now, we live in a tiny apartment in Indiana with our dog, Miguel. And we're having a baby. Who? Oh, son of a bitch. I'm Chelsea, and my life <laughs> is all about having fun. <laughs> I live in Vermilion, South Dakota, and I'm really close with both of my parents. But since they got divorced a few years ago, I mostly live with my dad, because I'm a total daddy's girl. Can we make this? Squash. I've been wanting it all day. My dad really gets me. Except when it comes to my boyfriend, Adam. Adam, like, changed his Facebook status, and it was like, I wish Chelsea wasn't such a whore and didn't want all my friends and just wanted me. Well, then I suppose we don't need to talk to him anymore, do we? 
ever. With me and Adam, there's always drama. He usually has a problem with whatever I do and whoever I do it with. Are you going to Jax? I have no idea. Well, I'll probably go, if that's OK. I don't know about that one. No matter how much drama we may have, he's in my life for good now, because I'm pregnant. Someone's got to get that pony tamed. <laughs> Hi, I'm Mackenzie. I'm 16 and live in Miami, Oklahoma. When I'm not outside riding horses, you can find me inside the gym. Competitive cheerleading is my life. Good one. And since I'm planning to cheer in college when I graduate in two years, I'm always trying to stick the most dangerous stunts. Until then, I live at home with my mom, dad, two sisters, and brother. Even though we're all super close, it's my boyfriend Josh who really gets me. Don't throw it that hard. He's an adrenaline junkie too and rides bulls. But since he's had a few concussions, he mainly rides wild horses now, but still competes in all the local rodeos. You go, boy. We're totally in love. Although we're both really busy, we're going to have to start spending more time together soon because I'm pregnant. <laughs>